Welcome back to our next video, and we wish you all a good day. May God bless everyone watching this video. Recently, Father Jim Bluant has issued a warning about potential risks related to February. He mentioned that he received a message from Our Lady indicating that something strange is happening in the world and something significant is about to happen. There are signs that atmospheric conditions could suddenly change, and threatening signs indicate a potential transformation in the sky itself. This warning implies that entire oceans could eventually swallow up an entire country. Additionally, there is a prediction that a strange and mysterious disease will emerge, overshadowing February. We hope you'll enjoy the video and subscribe to this YouTube channel to stay updated with the latest information. Join us and listen to this video until the end. Type Amen if you believe, may God always bless you. Before we discuss today's topic, let us pray, offering our prayers to God the Father. O Supreme God, in the name of Jesus Christ, your beloved Son whom you sacrificed to save us, your wretched children, from the fires of hell, please hear our prayers. We offer you our humble sacrifices. Grant us the strength and courage to overcome all hardships in life and to offer our sacrifices and deeds to honor your name and to help those around us. Amen. Christ is the loving and forgiving one, always extending his arms to welcome all who come to him with humility and repentance. May he grant us the strength and courage to overcome all challenges in life and to offer our sacrifices and deeds to honor him and to help those around us. Congratulations and prayers to all who trust in the Lord and seek his guidance and salvation. Amen. A wise spiritual advisor and shepherd of the faithful, Father Jim Bluant, earnestly warns humanity of the impending dangers associated with February. This profound advice stems from a divine revelation bestowed upon Father Jim during the sacred hours of the night before receiving the sacrament with Our Lady. After this wonderful conversation, Father Jim felt compelled to share a message of utmost importance with his fellow human beings. His remarks contain spiritual understanding and divine foresight, advising people to be vigilant and contemplative as they face any obstacles that February may bring. Now we will share this message with all of you. Every human being has been resurrected from the death caused by sin and has the opportunity to choose eternal life. To live and work according to God's plan and to pursue eternal life, the children of God must strive on this eternal day, gently trusting that their faith is not in vain. As a mother, I want my beloved children to experience eternal life, which is why every day during this holy week, I have given you the tools to become better children of the Holy Trinity and to live with your brothers and sisters. Without love, you are nothing. Now is the time for my beloved children to become deaf, blind, and silent to soothe those who do not follow God's will. They will be rendered incapable of seeing, hearing, or speaking. In February, the charming village of Medjugorje will witness an unprecedented storm that could completely engulf the area in 15 minutes or less. February will wrap the cold winter blanket around the ancient village of Medjugorje. The tranquil atmosphere that usually envelopes this village, famous for its beauty and spiritual significance, will soon give way to an unexpected scene of a night full of chaotic and fierce natural phenomena. The village nestled among gentle hills and historic buildings will be engulfed in tension as the sun gracefully sets, illuminating the sky with shades of orange and purple. It will seem as if the earth is awaiting an important moment to come. Those who usually enjoy the cool sea breezes will look at each other with caution. That night, people will be warned of the appearance of an unprecedented storm by distant thunder. The winds will pick up over time, teasing the ancient olive trees and revealing secrets to the tall cypress trees. Lightning will illuminate the dark sky, energizing the atmosphere and making everything unusually bright. 
the once serene community will find itself in the midst of a night of chaos and turmoil orchestrated by the harsh weather. Divine evidence demonstrates the resurrection of the Son of God, bringing hope to his offspring. Every person must be filled with love to offer themselves to their neighbors. The great law of love, in which my Son is present, is love for God above all else and for one's brothers and sisters. I love you. I keep you safe and bless you. Genesis 6 verse 17, to sweep away all life under the heavens, I will send a flood of waters onto this planet. All creatures on earth will eventually die, including all creatures. This passage from the story of Noah and the ark, where God tells Noah that he has decided to send a flood to remove evil from the earth. God instructs Noah to build an ark to save himself, his family, and representatives of each species. According to the biblical record, the great flood lasted 40 days and 40 nights, during which only those on the ark survived to begin a new community on earth. Now let us combine our hearts and minds in the collective spirit of prayer as we come together in this holy time. The passage addresses themes of human responsibility, purification, and divine judgment. It serves as a reminder of the emphasis of the story in the Bible about righteousness and obedience to God's plan. Now let us join together in prayer, O Mother Mary, you are God's beloved daughter, I entrust my soul to your care. Please protect God's life in my soul. Do not let me lose that life because of sin. Please protect my mind and will so that all my thoughts and desires may please God. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Thank you for watching until the end of the video. What do you think about today's topic? Leave a comment below and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, click the bell button next to it to receive notifications of the latest videos. In conclusion, we wish you all a day full of positive energy. May God protect you. Amen.